Hello friends, this video on determinant part 20 is brought to you by examfear.com. No more fear from exam. Before watching this video, please make sure that you have watched part 1 to part 19. Let's take one more example. We have to prove that the point A, B and C are collinear. So when you say point A, B, C are collinear, it means the area of triangle is 0. Correct? Three points are collinear. That means they all coincide. That means the triangle form using these three points, the area of the triangle is 0. So what we can do to prove that these points are collinear, I can have to prove that area of triangle ABC is 0. And what is the value of area of triangle? 1 by 2. Determinant of x1, y1, 1, x2, y2, 1 and x3, y3, 1. This guy is x1, this guy is y1, this guy is x2, y2, x3 and y3. So let's put the value. This is nothing bad. x1 is a, y1 is b plus c and then you have 1. x2 is b, y2 is c plus a and 1. x3 is c and this guy is a plus b, y3 and then you have 1. So this is my area of triangle. Now if you can see without even solving I can find the answer. How? Just by using the property. If you see this is a, this is b plus c, b, c plus a, c, a plus b. If I add these two this becomes a plus b, a, c, this becomes a plus b plus c and this also becomes a plus b plus c and I see that this column and this column will be proportional there. So let's try this. I'll say R1 is equal to R1 plus R2. So this becomes 1 by 2. R1 becomes, sorry, C1 is equal to C1 plus C2. I'm taking column operation. Right? So let me write again. C1 is equal to C1 plus C2. So this becomes A plus B plus C. This becomes B plus C plus A and this becomes C plus A plus B. Correct? C plus A plus B. This column is untouched and the next column is also untouched. In this, if I take A plus B plus C common, what I get is 1, 1, 1, B plus C, C plus A, A plus B, 1, 1, 1. And this I have done by saying c1 is equal to c1 by a plus b plus c and thus I can see that two columns are same so I can see that area is 0. Since the area is 0 that means the points are collinear. Very simple the concept was for three points to be collinear the area of the triangle formed using those three points will be 0. Here you define the value of the k if the area of the triangle is 4 square unit and the vertices are k0, 4, 0, 0, 2. Very sim same question almost. So this is guys x1, y1, x2, y2 and x3, y3 vertices of the triangle and we are told that area is 4 square unit. And what is the value of area? 1 by 2, x1, y1, 1 x2, y2, 1, x3, y3, 1. So this is the area we know. Replacing the value I get, x1 is what? k, y1 is 0 and this is 1. Here also x2 is 4, y2 is 0 and this is 1. x3 is 0, y2 is 2 and this guy is 1. So if you find this value, if you solve this, this comes out nothing but 1 by 2 into k into 0 into 1 is 0 minus 2 into 1 that is k into minus 2 plus 0 plus 1 into 4 into 2 8 minus 0 so 1 into 8. This is nothing but 1 by 2 into 8 minus 2k. Now I am told that area is 4 so that means 1 by 2 into 8 minus 2k can be plus minus 4. 
because the area is 4 this value can come out to be negative also if this is negative also minus 4 also in that case also area is 4 because we take absolute value if it comes out to be 4 then also we will take 4 as the value because we take absolute value so in that case 8 minus 2k is nothing but plus minus 8 2 into 4 so two option one is 8 minus 2k is 8 or 8 minus 2k is minus 8 so in this first case 8 8 cancel I get k is equal to 0 in the second case I get 2k is equal to 8 plus 8 is equal to 16 or I get k is equal to 8 so I have two values of k k is equal to 0 or k is equal to 8 that satisfies this condition correct so the question asked me find, uh, find the value of k so there are two values of k so the, the the learning from this example is that when I'm trying to find the value of k in such case, please make sure that you take plus minus area value. Don't only take plus values because even it comes out to me because the area is absolute value. Area is absolute value of the determinant by 2. Correct. So in that case, we'll take plus minus area. Now the question is we have to find the equation of line joining 1 by 2, 1 comma 2 and 3 comma 6 using determinant. How can we do this? Using matrices we have done, we have done in uh, this fashion, I think 1, 2, 3, 6 and then we have x, y kind, we, we have done like this. Now we have to do using determinant. How can we do? Now one thing to note here is. It says there's a line 1 comma 2 is this point 3 comma 6 is this point and there is any point x comma y we have to write the equation for this line one thing we can notice if we take these three points 1 2 x y and 3 6 the area of triangle that we get is 0 correct using these three points the area we get is 0 so what we can do is we can form the area of the triangle to be 0 using these points and the equation we can get will be the equation of the line. I'll tell you. Area is nothing but 1 by 2. x1, y1, 1. x2, y2, 1. x3, y3, 1. Correct. And this value is 0. Because area of triangle form using these three points will be 0. Because they all lie in a same line. What is the value of x1? 1 x2 2 and then 1 sorry this is y2 x2 is 3 y2 is 6 and then 1 x3 is x and y3 is y and this one now for this guy the area of triangle is 0 so let's find the value on the left hand side so this is nothing but 1 by 2 into or this will be doesn't make sense because this is anyway into 0 so gone so I can remove this guy so this is nothing but 1 into 6 minus y minus 2 into 3 minus x plus 1 into 3y minus 6x correct and this is equal to 0 if you solve this what you get you get 6 minus y minus 6 plus 2x plus 6y minus 12x is equal to 0 minus 6 plus 6 gone so what I get here is 6 minus 6y 12 minus 12x and this is 2x so this becomes minus 10x right so I get minus 10x plus y minus 5y plus 5y is equal to 0 or I get y is equal to 2x and that is the equation of my line so what I have done here I knew two points I just took the third point xy and then I have three points and I knew that these three points are part of the line so the area of triangle formed using these three points will be zero and thus I was able to get an equation out of that 
so in future if you get such questions where you are asked to find the area of or the equation of the line using determinant where you have two points given you can very well do this thank you visit examfear.com to watch free educational videos try free online tests get the best quality study materials study from the best tutors and mentors and much more thanks once again